this is the back end of the 311 flea market in Archdale or Sophia, wherever it is. Um, I always start in the back and work my way front because like everybody set up, sets up real early in the back. So you can start back here and work your all, way all the way down over that hill. There's a building and more stuff set up. So we'll go check it out. This is my favorite flea market in the area. Um, there's a lot more people you can't see, but down there we'll get to it, the rows. Really cool place. All right, so I'm getting ready to start walking around. Got a Red Bull. Um, see what kind of treasures we can find today. See any video games? Keep walking down this way. Go this way. All DVDs. There's a little mixing board. His Reeboks. Some fragrances. <laughs> so, so I'm the second best looking guy. <laughs> Alright, so this is what I found so far. I thought these were cool. These t-shirts. This guy framed them. They're vintage. I don't know the year. There's a copyright thing. I could figure it out when I get home. But um, this one was sick. Yeah, he framed the t-shirts. Looks pretty cool. And um, these, he had these under the table. I thought they weren't for sale, but they were. Yeah, here's a better shot of the t-shirts. Sun not on it. Pretty cool. How you doing, my friend? Hey, bud. I haven't seen you in a while. Look at that pupper. Just bought these two TI 83 plus calculators. Walk down to this next row. We're just there. The ice cream guy. He probably makes a fortune. I'm sure he drives a Cadillac. That pupper. That wind's picking up. So I just found two cool things. This is a Lego set that's never been opened. It's Ghostbusters. And this is real dirty and weathered, but it was five bucks. It's still sealed. But that's just cool. It's just the cool factor. Real cool find. I got to cut through back to the car and put this stuff up. 
They've even got a Dippin' Dots Italian ice. I'm gonna start walking down to another row. There's a bunch of buildings down here. That's what we're gonna go check out. I'm way back there. There's the exit. And there's people set up back there and on the other side of this main building, there's more outdoor buildings. I like to cut through here. There's different walkways like on that main road on the other side. Just like when I go to the building, I always use that back entrance because that's where all my favorite vendors are. Still walking down this thing, there's an empty table. Bought a couple of t-shirts. Blink-182 Neighborhoods. It's a 2011 tour. Pretty cool shirt. And this is like a reprint. I bought it because I'm going to wear it at the flea market. I thought that was pretty cool. It was brand new. I'll keep walking around. Might find something else cool. So while I'm out outside the building, I'm going to show that's the exit. They've tried to get people over the years to come in one way and go out the other way. And it's, it's not rocket science, but they finally put fences up at the entrance, so people have to go one way. Um, this is the entrance I usually take when I come in the flea market, because um, I'll be way in the very, very back, way, way, way over there. And I'll just make a straight line and come in this entrance. And um, there's a lot of cool stuff in here. I'll see if my buddy will let me videotape his um, video game booth. But let's check it out. What's up, man? What was that? <laughs> Alright, I'm walking back to the car. I walked around inside a little bit. It wasn't anything too spectacular. What I was looking for, the people weren't there today, so... We go back to the car, found a couple of good things. Um, one of those TI calculators had batteries in it and it was working. Like I saw it when I bought it. I just didn't take the batteries out and put it in the other one yet. But I'll do all that when I get home and clean everything up. That Wolverine action figure was pretty beat, but it's cool. It was a cool find and the Legos will pay for it. Any kind of time I find like a sealed Lego set, I try to buy it. But anyways, almost back to the car. This is the very, very back row. I'm just going to cut through when I get there. So I'm back at the car. Um, that's walking around the 311 flea market. It's a real cool place. I didn't show you the bathrooms because I'm not a pervert. But um, the bathrooms inside are good. There's Porta Johns out here. If you're interested in doing a spot, it's $10 first come, first serve for the outside. You have to talk to somebody about the inside. Anyway, y'all have a good day. Thanks for watching.